everybody! Welcome back! This is week five of Tween Art Journal, and today we're going to create a page that has a window in it, as you can see. I was hiding at you. Let's see. Um, so, we're going to take our long page from our journal. We took it apart, right? Take the clips off, and we're going to take a page, and you're going to fold that page in half. So, in half, and then in half on one side. Then you take your scissors and snip along here, make a window of some kind. It doesn't have to be like mine, it could be like anything. So then you unfold it. Okay, so that's half your page looks like that. The other half is still normal page, okay? So what I wanted to do is discover what, if you looked through a window and you saw yourself, what animal would you be? And what kind of thing would you want others to discover about you? So I thought about it and I thought about it and it took me two seconds to think about it. And I see myself as a cat. So what I did was I drew myself painting on a magic carpet because that's the first thing that came to my mind and I'm on the ocean I'm painting and I'm hanging out by the sunset so that's my ideal so what I'm doing is close the window there's me in the window okay now I'm gonna show you guys some techniques that you can use and you can decorate your window too. You can paint on it, draw on it, glue on it, tape on it, whatever you desire to do. And this page was from my previous video and this was an improv page. So this was just some wiggly lines for water and that actually got me started on this project. Um, that's where my mind went and I was like, well, wait a minute. Um, I knew I was gonna do draw yourself as an animal, but then I was like, you know, I really like the water. So that just got me going. And I was like, do I wanna be on a sailboat? No, I'd rather be on a magic carpet hovering the water so I can see fish and draw from life and explore and observe um, the ocean. So we're gonna make your window page and um, I'll be right back and we can I can show you what I did with the marker. Hi everybody, I'm back. Um, this is my quote unquote self-portrait as an animal. Um, like I said, kind of think about what you think that you would look like or as an animal or your favorite animal. Um, what I did here was I just used those colorful um, markers, just regular markers, nothing special. And I'm adding water to it again. And look how bright it's coming out. It is really cool. And um, it's almost like a fluorescent. And so then I made my uh, sunset on here. And I scribbled just different colors around. And now I'm gonna add some water to it. And I'm gonna spread it around to give it the feel of the sky where you see those dark clouds. This is all about observation, okay? So it's not, you know, it's not something that I only see. I'm trying to make you guys see it too, but you need to discover that for yourself by observing, okay? We observe and we learn that way. And that way we can draw things the way we see them. Look at that, that's kind of cool. So that's basically what happens when you put the water on the markers. I mean, I'm not even using watercolors right now. I did the watercolors down here before. I used pen. Oh, I like it a lot. So I'm just gonna just continue with my sky. And I urge you guys, take a, what would you describe yourself as? What kind of animal? Are you a giraffe? Do you like to see things from the top? Are you a dog of some kind? Your favorite dog maybe? Um, are you a cat too? Um, are you an animal from a zoo? How would you describe yourself? It's kind of like a self-portrait for your art journal. Cool. Yeah, it gives it kind of a lighter feel. Okay, awesome. Well, this is my self-portrait, my cat, and I will put her in her window. Let's see. 
So you can um, put this back in your book after it's dry. And that can be another page for your art journal. And I will see you guys in our next segment. We will see what we will be doing for the tweens next season. Okay, enjoy. Bye.